Good morning YouTubers Welcome to BMW Programming and Encoding Channel on YouTube We are looking at the BMW F30 here As you can see there the head unit is in blue Meaning it's in programming abort Something happens when somebody's trying to program that car right there Okay so We're going to um, Walk around it And take a look We are working with an ICOM next And Here's our cluster and here's the state and the condition of the control module. For, that's the CID there. Uh, this is the EDU unit right here, installed right here. And it's basically in programming aboard. Someone tried to write bootloader to it, as you can see. Show you bootloader on the screen there. It's not right there. So I just hope I can revive it. Oh, that is, uh, let's see. There's our BMW turbo here, boom. Here's our battery maintaining your snap on 32G, voltage maintained at 14.8. So remember that, YouTubers. Our return. So we we're gonna go here and fall codes. Oh water? Not not yet, not as it, not as it. Not not yeah, not oh not as it, not as it. We are looking at vehicle configuration data could not be read here. We have roughly uh, six fault codes and uh, we have Oh, that's in German. I don't know what that means. Instrument panel message for condition based service and then no communication possible with the head unit Programming aboard in the head unit. All right, cool. We're gonna see if we can do a uh, A software update here. Let us calculate measure plan as you can see the actual eye level is of 2019, uh, 07 July, 5.30 and then we have latest eye level target in ISTA D as 2020 of March 03 and the software version of that eye level target is 5.40 Alright, so we're going to try to restore this car and do it Alright, so let us see if we can execute measure plan here Alright, we're going to say right here we should go check for CD in DVD USB right there in the car so we go we go here we check 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 all right let me go here and i do what, what do i do here power then click eject nothing comes out all right and we go here we look if we have any um USB in this thing. Man, this thing is loaded. I do the basic, I don't know if any USB is here, so shut this back. Alright, so the first record, click continue. Let us make sure that there's no card running over there, and the window is okay, door is closed, blah blah blah. Alright, this is remaining one minute. We have to go here, service plan, and go here, programming plan. Let us see if we're gonna perform a gateway measure, repair measure. Let's hope we do it successfully. Alright. Yeah, the head unit is taking the file. It's taking the file now. It is it making a progress. It started the progress of writing to it. First it showed me a red X that it failed. It showed me right here. Yeah. First that it failed. But now it shows a progress bar. So I guess we get the network right. Yeah, just Alright, let's go to the car. Alright, my phone almost dropped. All right, YouTubers, take a look at the flash, the software flash file that is not written to it. Transfer data, software flash file that is read from the laptop to the car now, there it goes. Boom. So we wait. Uh. Let's go there. Let's do the basic and so. Oh, we pause video for now and we wait. 
Alright, this is the work we're going to see the file writing. Let us look at which file is being reflected on the head unit. Oh shit, let me zoom out. Oh, it's writing that file there that says uh, the file ID is 0003BBE. That's why important job, you know what I mean? Let me go here and um, take a look. So writing the software flash file to it. Three B C one. Boom. If it failed again, if it failed again, I'm going to try to use my genuine icon A2. Because that one, is that genuine next? Mm -hmm. That's a genuine uh, Oh, next. Okay, cool. Alright, it does fail it again. No, this is going to give me problems anymore. Don't pause with her. It's writing the manual to the car now. The manual is being written. That's the iPad right there, the manual has been written. I just hope it, it, it does it real well and, and I can be happy. Shit. Oh gosh. It's right in the manual, the user manual. See it fail, you see that? Fail that shit. Let me let me re minimize this. Wow, look how far we reach, you see that? One minute. I wonder if it's gonna fail. <laughs> Woo man, I just hope it really. Oh, it, it, it do it successfully. Look at the green thing. You see that? I didn't see it. It does the, it does the programming. Mm. You see the green thing? And then it jumped to this. It's now stored the integrated operation instruction, which is called the iBAN. It's doing it. Shit, it's really, really working. Because you remember when you see the red X, the second red X, you remember? Yeah, it's not the first time. Man, damn, it really, really, it really works. Because I was wondering what I'm going to do next because I'm communicating to the edu unit over the network path 192 right. and that is why I was, I, I was sometimes I first when I'm doing something I'd fail I, I expect it not to fail but programming board you can rewrite over the programming as long as the bootloader is not damaged right. oh gosh man alright let me pause this now it's going through okay oh boy Here's our iBot, the manual there, the programming file has been written successfully to it, and so on. And there goes, it comes back on, there's the radio light comes back on again, boom. The iCom next work. Let me go here, and look. Alright, we just... Everything coded and programmed now. Let me see now the hard, the hard drive is booting up inside there. There it goes. Come on. Alright, here's it come up now. You see the CID working out? The head unit is back, the radio is back, everything is back. Okay. Alright, so this job is done well. No big deal. All right, it said your engine code at level low, blah, blah, blah. Right, so. All right, it soon come back up, no big deal. CID comes up. Right now, when I take this off, so really, it's really brand new to me. When I turn it up, All right. it's that high. So I feel okay, like so this is just that. This is. So you can just replace this with the part number done. All right, bro. Well. Big program on okay.
I say metro plan here completed. So we're gonna we're gonna look here and um, we said these are the follow-up operations to be done. So we're gonna we're gonna perform these operations now. We're gonna execute metro plan here. Performing these follow-up operations here. To the animal level. I changed my dog like that, you know? Yeah. Right up high level, vehicle profile, high level, software, blah blah blah. Alright, it says right here. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, so far so good. Make sure plan completed successfully. So we're gonna um, ABL delete form and we're gonna go back here, vehicle management. As you can see, no control units left here to be updated. All right, we go here. And here's it here, see that? It's all green, there it goes. Our NBT, head unit basic, see that? There we go. Cool. Okay, YouTubers. So far, so good. We finished program the um. We finished program the. Oh, this is Eddie. Unit. Connected drive. Blum blum blum. Alright, the head unit is back. We restored it over the modem, the ATP router, and that's it. There it goes. Blum, blum, blum. Alright. Alright. So, thank you for being my YouTube channel. YouTubers. We're going to um on the phone now. Disconnect this, put it here. Disconnect that, put it here. We're gonna try to get a start on this. So far, so good, YouTubers. All right, we're gonna see if we can close out this video now. All right, now we're gonna get a radar plane. The head unit is back. All right, so YouTubers, thank you for viewing my YouTube channel. Thank you for viewing my BMW programming and encoding channel on YouTube. I am out. All right, let us go. We're going to go back to the computer screen and take another look at the. Uh, I'll do that later. Let me go back here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, YouTubers. Thank you for being my channel. I am out. Boom.